I wonder if you've got any thoughts about Margaret's opinion of men and relationships and how a lady should interact with men, yeah. marriage and so on and so Because she has got an interesting marital history she herself, does. doesn't she? She does. At this point, I think she's the widow of, of Philip II, who was the Duke of Savoy. Um, but Margaret, Margaret's court also, I think, epitomises that kind of early modern courtly love, um, the chivalric celebrations of courtly love, I think you can really see at Margaret's court. She was famed for, um, you know, holding a tight household. They were a very pious household, um, but they were also a household who were engaged in these kinds of um, pageants involving chivalric celebrations. So I think this really is where Anne would have learnt those, those key skills of flirting in an appropriate way, but also it was an important part of court language really and an, and an important part of, of a woman's place in court.